what we do is, is, is such a blessing, you know. And I don't want to take this for granted. And I know how special it is to be here, so I'm, I'm trying to treat it as such. Do you like, I mean, you, you have to like being involved in a chess match between Andy Reid and Doug Peterson, right? I mean, you guys are a bunch of smart receivers that can move around different places here, and they have the same thing. So in what could be a shootout game, that's something you guys probably are excited about. Right? Yeah, I got a healthy respect for Andy Reid. And after spending, you know, this entire year with Doug, not knowing much about him before we had got a chance to meet, I have so much respect for Doug and the way that he approaches things. He's got his quirks of how he operates and stuff. And he's got his sayings and all that stuff. But if you look at the, the heart of what he's saying, man is an unbelievable person. He cares about his team. And he's brought us here to this point. So to have them two face off again, I'm sure it means a lot to him. Um, I won't put too much, you know, put words in his mouth. I'm just from the outside looking in. But it's hopefully going to be an awesome game. Offenses going at it, defenses making plays. And this is what we play for, right? I talked about it a couple of weeks back of like these moments that you get. And we're embracing it. Guys are still having fun enjoying themselves, just, you know, loving on each other. So it's, it's really dope to be a part of. Hey, what do you remember most from that first meeting between the Chiefs and the Jags? Uh, that we lost, honestly. Uh, that was tough. Um, I felt like I played a decent game, but still left so much out there uh, that I would like back. Uh, you know, I think the offense as a whole, we wanted a lot back. Um, yeah, the loss and there are a few things that, that didn't really shake our way is what I remember the most. Defensively, how have they changed from then to now? Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't see a whole lot of drastic changes. Uh, I see some DBs maybe have shifted around the nickel and base and things like that. Uh, they're a young group. This is a physically talented group. Uh, they got DBs with a lot of range, a lot of strength move well, confident. I got a lot of respect for LeJarrius Sneed as well. Plays nickel and can go outside. Uh, their front is really, really good. Um, their pass rush, we got some guys up there we need to stop. Uh, linebackers are playing very, very fluid. I think Gay is an awesome player. So, I mean, how have they changed? I wouldn't say it's been drastic changes, but they've proven that what they do is as effective and works. For you guys, um, when you look at you know the fact that you win on Saturday first and foremost, but you know all the hype now and the the videos and the improbable, I think it was like teams are you guys are three and two, went down 17 points, and in the history of this franchise, they were like one and one to 26 or something yeah. before then. I mean, I know you guys are tunnel vision, but has it set in what you guys did on Saturday? Um, I'm a reminiscent type person. Uh, I'm not ashamed to say that. I just I try to cherish moments as they come. So I definitely have, uh, for myself, at least recognized that. And I've been very grateful for that opportunity. And also grateful that my, my parents got to be there. My little sister got to be there, uh, celebrate with them and hug on them. And, and, you know, this is as far as I've been in the NFL. And I've been in the, in the league now for six years. And that's a testament to how hard it is to, to get to that position. And I don't take that for granted. And I'm not taking this moment for granted. Um, obvious. Obviously, you know, there's there's a chance that we won't win or, you know, we could win in advance. And so I'm just trying to soak up these moments that we have with these guys and with this team and, and be here in these moments. So long-winded way, I know I can speak a lot, but I have cherished uh, what we did in the history of, of the Jags. Yeah. Mic drop right there.